They're going to guide that onto those long steel rods sticking up out of the segment. And then they'll lock it into place and that'll lift the segment up onto the cantilever. Each of our segments weighs between 160 and 200 tons. And uh, there's just a, a web of rebar running through each one of them. That's what gives it the strength. We have 17 million pounds of rebar throughout the bridge. So there's a lot of steel. One of the more frequently asked questions that we have as, during our sidewalk superintendent talks is about quality. The quality based on how fast we're progressing this job and, and ultimately how that correlates to the safety of the structure and the performance of the structure. And historically, in Minnesota at least, we haven't seen projects built this quickly and I think that's what's generating this question. And um, I think what we're showing and what we're learning is that we do not have to sacrifice quality and safety in order to build it quickly. We're very happy with where we're at as far as the quality of the job. We're, we're achieving very high strength concrete. Uh, there's very little work that has to be redone. Uh, eliminating that rework is really what's allowing Flatiron to progress the job as quickly as they are. In addition to working on multiple aspects of this job at the same time, you see all four approach spans to the main river span being constructed at the same time when you're out here, and that is not a usual approach to construction. So we're very comfortable with the structural integrity that we're going to have that correlates the safety of this structure and the performance, long-term performance, and we're very confident this is going to perform uh, for a minimum of 100 years. The closer we get to the end, we're realizing that we're clearly going to meet our deadline and we'll probably finish early. There's a tremendous sense of pride in having worked so hard to achieve that and seeing the Twin Cities triumph over tragedy.